Take inventory of all the chopped vegetables you didn't use in the skewers, plus a couple mini bell peppers from some dude's retirement party. Pour oil into a pan to saute the onion. Immediately realize the pan you picked is way too small. Mince onion and roll around in small pan to pick up the last of the oil from it. Add to hot pan. Dump cherry tomatoes. Spend the next five minutes awkwardly cutting them with the spatula because you didn't think to do that ahead of time. Add healthy splash of balsamic vinegar and pepper to taste. Boil down into a paste. Discover that you used way too much oil. Remove from heat and add chopped fresh basil. Wipe splattered oil off of computer. Pour excess oil into bottom of baking dish and add one pound of... <coughs> I... wanna say... Trout? Grouper? River bass? I, I know it wasn't tilapia. Ah, fuck it. Some kind of white fish. Spread tomato stuff over fish and place in oven. Remove from oven because you just realized cooking it uncovered like that will turn it into a brick. Begin measuring rice out of bag with annoyingly small opening. Get so frustrated that you forget how many scoops you've taken. Dump it out of the cooker and start over. Take time out of your life to chase stray grains around your counter. Finally get the rice properly measured. Add slices of lemon that you got for something else but you don't remember what. Add a pinch of whole peppercorns that end up making no difference. Slice mushrooms and mini peppers. Cook in same pan used for tomato stuff. Add squashes, again neglecting to cut them up ahead of time. Whip out some old salad topping. Take down mortar and pestle from where they've been gathering dust and plant debris. Fix that. Crush pecans into a sandy mush. Cover fish with pecan dust and broil five minutes. Add bell peppers to veggie pan. Spend some time fishing out chunks that really have gone round the bend. Take a moment to behold your glorious creations. Plate it up nice and purdy. Save flavored fish oil for later use. Eat it. Yum. I honestly don't have much else to say. This turned out great. <laughs> Like this is this is this is delicious. I'm I'm happy with this. I've got no other comments. Um, I'll just let you know. Um, hmm. uh, just make sure you start the rice at the right time because <laughs> I ended up waiting like an extra ten minutes because I forgot to turn the rice on at the same time that I put the fish in. But it turned out okay. And if you prefer your rice a little bit looser than this, this turned out kind of you know sticky. And use a little bit less water. Especially since I was using lemon slices, I should have used like three and a half cups of water. Yeah, I should have taken a little easier. And I'm usually a little more generous with the rice, but I get really annoyed. Like I was trying to get the... Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> you got the idea. This is really good, so I'm going to go eat it now. So thanks for watching. Go try some of my other recipes. If they're good, tell me how much you like them. If they suck, tell me how to fix them while you're in the comments. You can ask your questions and leave suggestions. You know how YouTube works. Do all the things. And I'll see you in the kitchen.